my bleeding feet. Oh, hello, Mrs. Joseph. Oh, I like your hair. What do you call that? Strawberry blonde? Gan, you're only jealous. <laughs> Here, girl, what you got for the old man's supper tonight? Him? If he's lucky to get back at some piece of pud, he will. We well, can't do much on that, can he, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, dearie. Thank you. Here, girl. Wouldn't mind having this little lot in my stocking for Christmas, oh, eh? Yeah. <laughs> and you wouldn't know what to do with it. You've been a widow too long. You speak for yourself. It's like riding a bicycle. You never forget how. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll send my Alfie along to you. He's not bad once he gets going. Well, I hope he's well sprung. <laughs> 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 I'm caught in again. Oh, you're not. I met him up at the mission, you know, one of them shilling yeah. dinners for old age pensioners. He kept asking me to go up to tea. Of course, I knew he had a place of his own and that his wife had been dead 18 months, but I didn't fancy going up there. Because you know what men are, don't you? All right, as long as you keep your hand on your apron. You ought to know. But I went up Sunday and cooked his dinner for him. Of course, it went off cold up there. Here, you ought to got a fire going for me, I says. Why, you cold duck, he says. Get under them covers. <laughs> they never know when they're past it, do they, Mrs. Hardy? <laughs> well, what do you want? I've not taken any ready you money. Yeah, you all you've got is straws. I don't know. Well, you, you all wear them, them, don't you? Blimey, I says, when he asked me to be his housekeeper. Don't swear here, he says. This is Gord's house. Well, Gord might tip me, I says. Now then, now then, what do you want? But I don't really want to get married again. Oh, I'm oh, such no. a rotten husband. You used to give me 38 bob a week and stop two bob income tax. Call the minji oh. son. Oh. This one's 74 and he's got 50 quid. He's promised to take me to Bromsgrove for a oh, no. That'd be lovely. <laughs> Mind you, I've been a widow for 14 years and I know how to look after myself. And even if I don't, there ain't much chance of me getting the family way now, is there? <laughs> Any peace, Thrupens? Here. Nice pair of wooden undies here. Oh, I'll have them. Oh, they're rotten at the crutch. <sighs> Turn it up, Nogga. What's the matter with you? Scummy Lil was here yesterday. Come round after buying a pair of drawers. Held them up against us, she did. Come off it, I said. What do you want with a pair of drawers? Hey, right yeah, now. what do you want for this lovely thing here? That turban? Yeah. Shilling. Really wants Shilling? Yeah. I'll give me tuppence. Uh, walked by a film star, that was, I must tell you. <laughs> she told me to keep it quiet. Oh, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> here you Look. Know. Robin Hood shoes, they are. Robin Hood. What about that? Yeah, for once of that, then I can't the find other it. Somebody's knocked it off. A one legged bloke must have knocked it off. Give yeah. that to your old man with a soft shoe when really he kicks you, no. he won't feel it. It's lovely to live here in the forest. Uh, you can keep it, Ducky. Can't stand it. Huh? No, it's this weather. Oh. oh, I'm a martyr to the rheumatism. Are you? Oh. I mean, every time you put something new on, down comes the rain. Yes. Mm. No, soon as Richard comes back, I'm jacking it all in. I mean, my small holding has gone to rack and ruin. Well, I don't suppose it gets much use. Robin, I think it's marvellous the way you rob the rich and give it to the poor. <laughs> you have to be joking. You don't? Of course we don't. Keep it all ourselves. How do you think we get all this bone a drag? Doesn't count trees, no. I hope you won't misunderstand what I'm about to say. But you see, I always thought that you and your merry men were more sort of... <clears throat> you see, and they're sort of... <laughs> I always thought that you and Maid Marian were... Uh, at it. <laughs> you must be mad. Maid Marian? Have you ever met her? Uh, no, I haven't had that pleasure. <laughs> Where are you? Over here, Petal. What do you want? Five bleeding hours I've been riding. I've got something to tell you. Prince John's up at Nottingham Castle and he's got a big shake on. The bloody king's back in the country, so you better get your finger out and have a go. And who, pray, is this fragile wood nymph? This is the Maid Marian. Ah. Pardon? Maid Marian. That explains a lot of things. Well, you can't really blame him, can you? Well, I mean, could you? With her. <laughs> so you are the beauteous maid, Marion. How do you do? Not very often, thank you. Ah, your reputation has spread far and wide. 
And that's not the only thing by the look of it. Have you eaten, Heartface? No, I'm starving, angry. Oi, shag nasty! Oh. Get that bleeding deer cut up and bang us a leg! To think we could have got Julie Andrews for the same money. Back up, a bit more. A bit more. And a bit more. Come on now. Come on. Back up. Look this way. Back up. <laughs> <laughs> Pass him easy and don't drop him. Oh, told chap. You was bleeding while going off without me, wasn't you? No, I did you. We were not going without you. Yes, you bleeding well was. <laughs> no, we were not, Ada. And this is a funeral and we don't want any swearing. Call that. Bleeding and swearing. Wait till I get to the cemetery. Okay, dear. Look, dear, we don't want any scenes this time. Well, if she's going, see, she's got her knickers on. <laughs> you mind your own business. I've got me drawers on, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> they don't come off as often as yours. <laughs> What do I mean? You had a lovely bleeding war, didn't you? All them Canadians! Oh, 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 oh,